Hey guys, Impulse191 here, welcoming you back to another live OU Mono battle. Today's battle will be against the Blazing Aura, whose name I slightly forgot there for a second. And he will be using the... What type is he using? Oh, oh, he's using poison. He just told me and I forgot again. Wow, so disorganized. I'm going to be using a Blast from the Past, a uh, wall range ice team that I made for him a long time ago. So... If you're excited for this episode, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button down below, and we will get over this team builder real quick. And hopefully we can get going. This time I'm not going to make mistakes like I did last time. So we've got Power Ranger, the Mammoth Swine with Choice Scarf, Stone Age, Earthquake, Ice Crush, and Knock Off. We've got Yeti the Abominus Snow with a Icy Rock to prevent to uh, prolong the ice. That's no warning. With Leech Seat Protect, Wood Hammer, and Blizzard. We've got Wall the Wall Rain with Leftovers. Bit of a stoly set, as you can see on the screen. We got Nikkei the Jinx with its Focus Sash, which we are going to lead with. It's got Lovely Kiss, Ice Beam, Side Shock, and Energy Ball. We've got Baby the Frost Slash with the Bright Powder because we're dirty, dirty people. Uh, it's got Sub, Destiny Bond, Thunder Wave, and Blizzard. And the bottom, we have got Closed the Cloister, which is which has got a Focus Sash. It's also got Ice Shard, Rock Blast. Icicle, Spear, and Shell Smash, that's the one. So, I'm going to just jump into this battle because he has already invited me. I'm going to hope that this doesn't mess up. This is going to be live. Yes, it is. It's live right now. So, good luck, and hopefully we will not get destroyed. I am expecting a Nido King. Yo. No, that's two. Yo. Good luck. Let's get into this battle. And boom, boom, boom. Shake the room, boom. Except we're on. We're on. Alright. Mmm. Let me have a look. What is going on? The camera has froze on. There we go. Alright. Been having a lot of camera problems for some reason. I don't know if it's the settings or what. But we are going to see that, uh, what don't we like there? We don't like Mega Beedrill, if that is Mega Beedrill. But some non-existent Stealth Rocks will be able to take care of that. Do we even have Stealth Rocks? No! Alright. Nikki's coming out. Ignore that. That is the Logitech software that is messing up. We're faster than you. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. All right. This is the answer. Psy shock. Let's go psy shock. We've got to psy shock everything before Nikki dies. Psy shock's gonna do a huge amount of damage. Was that a critical hit? I think it was. I didn't see properly, but I'm gonna have a look in a second when that text moves out of the way and scrolls up. So it's a big first turn. Second turn. Goes to the Shadow Sneak, gets some destroying them, but we hang on with the Sash, which is really fortunate. It was it wasn't a crit. Wow. That was huge damage. So now we've got to look out for priority. I won't lie to you, Drapia. Yeah? I don't know if you've got priority or not. I know that you're immune to psyche though. But, what can we do to you? What can we do to you? I mean, Nikki is so valuable, even at 1 HP. Because there's nothing on your team that has priority. I'm guessing. So I'm going to preserve this, knowing that you probably haven't got Stealth Rocks on your entire team. We're risking that anyway. Um, what are you going to do? You can just hit off with any sort of poison move you like, and you will be good. I think I'm just going to um, not go into that because that would be a terrible play if it uses a type poison type move. What, we can't really do anything. I mean, I could go into this and start firing off lizards, but it's not 100% accurate because there's no snow up. Hail, not snow. Alright, you didn't have a blue ended yet? Nope. Alright, well, I'm going to go into Power Ranger. We're going to get knocked off. We lose our choice scarf. Terrible for us. But, at the very least, you don't have anything that levitates. 
or flies because Beedrill is not a flying type right now. So we're going to be able to fire off an earthquake and get some major damage going on. I guess Victory Bell is going to come in and take a neutral shot. Nope, he's just going to stay in, survive on 2%. Victory Bell pops and it's going to recover a little bit and we are going to go down. That crit did not matter in the slightest. So what do we want to go out now? Uh, I'm guessing... Well, that that could potentially be a speed tie and I don't feel like that's a good, good plan at all. We've got another focus sash. We could get shell smash off and get some um, beats going. What resists anything there? Nothing really. Alright. That's what we're going to do. Am I forgetting something? He has got knock off. We're going to shell smash. He goes for the earthquake. Doesn't do a great deal because we are bulky. Uh, not anymore though because we have beats. So Icicle Sphere is the one that hits five times, right? Boom. Yeah. Icicle Sphere is. Icicle Spear, not Spear. It's not a wall. It's not a Sphere. So we're going to take that down and I don't think he's got an answer to this guy. We break Focus Sashes. Uh, we break Legs. So it's pretty, it's pretty bad all around. I think that will be the game. Um, you are a dragon type, part dragon, so you're going to go down so quickly to this. Wow. I think this could be, potentially, the game. But we'll see. Maybe he has got something that he could come out with. Victory Bell's going to come in. I'm just going to keep hitting that ice move. Because it's, it's too big, it's too dirty. And he's going to take care of Victory Bell pretty easy. Nido Kings are going to come in, it's asleep, we're going to hit for super effective damage again. And, um, yeah, Closed is really sweeping here. And finally, Beedrill comes in, and we are going to, oh, we should have Rock moved it, but I don't think it really matters what move we use against it. Is it Mega? That is the question. It is Mega, uh, but he doesn't have Protect, so he doesn't outspeed us this turn. If he had Protect, he could have... If we just still out we would have still outsped. So good game dude. Um if you've enjoyed this episode, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button down below and check some of the videos that you see out over there. And of course the easy access the subscribe button is down below. Anyway guys, I will see you in the next episode. Later.